Just a moment. But first here at 6, a judge has ruled on what will be allowed as evidence in the federal lawsuit against the city of Bakersfield, stemming from an attack that was the result of mistaken identity. 17's Kristen Price joining us now with the latest. Kristen? Tammy, police stopped Tatiana Hargrove in June 2017 as they searched for a man with a machete who threatened a manager at a nearby store on Ming Avenue. Officers say Hargrove matched the description. A video of Hargrove describing the confrontation went viral when the NAACP posted it on its Facebook page. The video showed a bruised and bandaged Hargrove telling her side of the story. Hargrove was initially charged with five misdemeanors, including assault on a peace officer. But District Attorney Lisa Green determined there was not enough evidence to convict Hargrove and the charges were dropped. Six months after the initial incident, Hargrove filed a lawsuit against the city claiming officers used excessive force, beating her and having their canine attack her. We haven't heard much about the case since then. A mid-discovery status conference was scheduled tomorrow, but the court website no longer lists the hearing. A federal judge ordered a portion of Hargrove's school records and employment history will be included as part of the case. The next deadline in Hargrove's case is scheduled for April. Kristen Price, 17 News.